This episode is sponsored by Honey Badger. Honey Badger has your back when it counts. They're the only air tracker that combines air monitoring, uptime monitoring, and cron monitoring into a single and simple to use platform. Their mission is to tame production and make you a better, more productive developer. In this episode, we're going to have a look at Hotwire and implementing Hotwire into a new Rails 6.1 application and using it to interact with Vue Component. And the Vue Component library is something that was created by and maintained by GitHub and it really is a great project for extracting out a lot of logic from your views into plain old Ruby objects. And this will not only make it easier to test those individual components, but they're going to be highly reusable and they can also be made to where they are very isolated. So in this episode, we're going to create a to-do list where we have a list and then a list has many items. And we'll create a few different components. This whole new item where we can create a new item is going to be one component and each item will be their own component as well. And we click on one of the complete links, it's going to automatically update the text that we see without refreshing the page or anything. And that's going to be thanks to the hot wire and specifically the turbo portion of that library. And did you know that you can go to railstore.com to get your own Ruby on Rails t-shirt or your Drift and Ruby t-shirt. So be sure to check that out and use the promo code Ruby for free shipping within the United States. To watch this full episode and more videos, visit driftandruby.com and subscribe to the pro membership.